I'm Ron McGill, and this is the Dromedary Camel. There are two basic types of camels. There's the dromedary, which is the one hump, and there's the bactrian, which is the two hump. And a good way to remember the difference, take the letter D from dromedary, put it on its side, how many humps does it have? One. Take the letter B from bactrian, put it on its side, how many humps does it have? Two. So that tells you how to tell the difference right away. These animals are built for the desert. A lot of people have the misconception to say that camels store water in their hump. It's not really true. What's stored in their hump is fat. But camels are one of the few animals that can lose up to 40% of their body weight in the desert and still survive living off of that fat. They have all kinds of other specialties. They can actually close their ears. They can close their nostrils. They have very special feet that pad out so they can walk in the sand very easily without sinking. This is basically an animal that is built for the desert, custom deluxe. In the wintertime, it can grow a very thick coat. And when it gets really hot, it can lose that coat very easily. This is an animal that for over a thousand years has been a beast of burden. It really has replaced animals like the horse throughout Africa. So though people consider the camel wild, it is domesticated in most of the world. That's your facts about the dromedary and bactrian camels.